think it was on the bottom tiers on that tier list I saw. Yep, some showed up. Oh, it was Orochi. Well, I hit everything you got, so... Well, not before the Orologian breaks. Well, that was actually faster than the last time with Flash Arrow with more damage. Thanks for messing around with some more. Vampire Survivor's Bezoic Gabadoni is going home to Mount Moonspell. And he is bringing weapons that I do not want to use. Melee Bole Blue is terrible. It will not be evolving. And instead, I will be using some Operation Guns weapons to keep going because I have lost at the 29 minute mark again. Means. Well, I don't want to be playing them anymore. Boy, is it annoying losing that far in. Da, 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 da. So we're going time warp to keep nice and safe at the end. And double Operation Guns weapons to get as many revives as possible. Outside playing the actual Operation Guns characters. And homing miss will be consistent close range DPS to keep Gavadoni in a semblance of life. No issue until the 28 minute mark. Everything else was going down. Even Orochi didn't last long. But as soon as it hit that mark, everything was a living. Nothing was dying. And I was out of position for my f chicken forts. Immediately to keep those going. So that wasn't fun. But I still made it to three of them. I popped three chicken forts and it still wasn't enough to last two minutes with five revives. With Awake powering each and every last one of them. So, that's why it's time warp now. There's some last into time warp. Get another revive out of it, and I will start freezing and defanging them. Not even Gavit only could mess up in that circumstance, right? Right? Heck, I even popped an Aura Logan in two. It still wasn't enough. Get that luck -a going. Uh, I just annihilated the Atlanteans in like a second or two. The big skeleton guys, no trouble either. Flash Arrow was doing thousands of damage, and it still was not enough. Speaking of still not enough, I gotta go take down the skeletons so I can get their evolution chests going. Gotta go fast. Gotta go fast. Big level. Well, let's get the wings up just in case that will feel like rolling as an evolution chest. It did not. So it's boss time. It's skeleton time. Not skeletonari time though. That was two days ago. Big ball off. It is entirely why he has the boat che. Because he's a tanuki. Oh, hey, double plum roll. Well, this is much slower. Flash arrow before I even had the bounce took it out before any of the fire spirits spawned. Right, let's do the time warp again. Maybe this time it won't be terrible. Yep. I can just mow through them all. If you're not frozen, you're defanged. Alright, take out the other skelly here. Then I guess get the Atlanteans. Them four golden eggs stronger. Took them out with no trouble. Of course, with just that final crazy wave. Is that only because of the beginning? That means... Well, actually, no, it wouldn't. You only get three amount off the beginning. Well, Gavit only here would pull out four as well, Samundo. So they would get more, but they would lose more might off of Sign Old Sanctuary if you wanted to go heavy into making sure that's all set up. 
And specifically, it was Flash Arrow. I didn't get Millionaire, no Bracer. I thought it would be a good idea. Well, heck, if I had Millionaire over Uru Bole, probably would have been a win. What am I doing? Gotta take out the Atlanteans. Wow. Well, amount one for you is still amount one, even if it's terrible. First big level up storm and then random always. Oh, well, I guess duration. It really won't help though. Slow, slow, slow. Yeah, I went as slow as possible and it still almost hit me. Well. Yeah, feels like there's something weird with the amount going on right now. It doesn't it feels almost too fast for the cooldown. Well, I guess I could get candy rocks to try get boo boo role. Seems unlikely, but hey, especially because these aren't gonna be candy box chests, and why I Boo. Really need to make sure I don't need to move immediately after a level. Not I don't have Vento Sacro or I guess Shadow Pinion or Valkyrie Tuner. Or for Wolf of Wallow. I can just hold out for just a tiny bit. Man, it's not getting it at all. Weird. Huh. Oh, hey, where's a chest there? It's not gonna be a candy box, but I might as well roll the dice just in case somehow it was super, super mega lucky. Well, it's Gavadoni, that's not gonna happen. That definitely feels weird. It doesn't feel like 69 cooldown should be keeping it up this consistently. They don't have a duration increase either. Well, Chesto. It's in Japan, so that means Chesto is correct. Ah, character base, right in. Sekiro, Sekiro. Man, I'm more for just crushing them. I guess that sheer amount of amount is too much of an amount for them to amount over. Well, let's see. Yep. Heck, that's like, what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Well, we'll have to see how well it plays out in the end. It might not even matter. It can go so far. Only to lose it all. Huh, they not have, like, uh, what's it called? Delay frames? Cooldown frames? Hit delay, hit delay, yeah, that was it. Where are you? Is that you? Okay, it was hard to see, because I thought you got pushed back somehow. I can't even move in. I don't even have all the amount yet. That'll be in a bit. There we go. Okay, four naturally is five, plus two Peter, that's seven. Alrighty. Much amount as I'm getting outside, random rolling. Random limit break rolling. And it's 14 minutes in. Yay, yapping. Wonder how long yapping is gonna be in the current online vernacular before it gets replaced by something else. Things just move so fast. Last month's meme is already gone. Remember when music slapped? Now it's a banger. In a few months it's gonna be something like... Stomping or thrashing.
Let's bring back the ye old timey. Oh, oh, I don't even have the second Arcana yet. Uh, well, it's already guarantees a freeze. I can hold off on Awake. I'm strong enough for that. Maybe out of bounds. That should increase the DPS substantially. Yeah, look at that plow up. Crazy. Wait, what? Is it random chance? I thought it was guaranteed on freeze. Am I mistaken? As I am again, and again, and again, and again, and again. Throughout the whole of my life. Man, yeah, just nothing for them. Forge fallen. Blasting them all. Wrecking them all. Man, I'm actually killing them fast enough that they're spawning in in squares. That's odd. Usually I don't get that with Tengu. Run through them. Shove them out of bounds. Give them a time warp. It is nice. Well, then again, there was no issue last time till 28 minutes. And I got... I mean, Orochi almost killed them. Got down to a sliver of health, but... Oral Logans plus chicken. Well, heck. If I had popped the Oral Logans for that, I probably would, would have... Done them all for a final. And in fact, I'm probably gonna situate myself next to them. Just in case. Because, oh boy, do I not want to... Why this... As yet another bloody loss. Been enough loss. As it is. I don't post it because it's not interesting. Also, I start swearing like... Well... I'll just say I tend to swear more than I have in all the past eight months combined. Every time I lose. Hoo 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 hoo. Yeah, I think I'm still at like maybe five swears between the hundreds of hours of content I've put out. When you have fewer swears than videos in a week, you knew you're doing something. Right? Wrong? Maybe if I swore more, I would get more attention. Oop. I have sold out completely. Give me a million subscribers. Remember back in ye olden days, I considered an idiot a swear and just not a general purpose insult. And then general purpose insult has become a swear and a slur. Ah, uh, the ever-changing vernacular of the world. Alright, awake? You better be here. Why wouldn't you be there? I didn't select you. No, oh, the weaker Onis are getting mowed down, like the green grass they secretly are. There's only three Onis, right? Blue, green, and yellow. No, there's a red variant, right? Well, I suppose we'll be seeing. Hopefully we'll be seen. And I survive. Oh, dang it, I grabbed one of the Aura Logans. I right, just stop moving and stick near the spot. Okay, go down, grab it immediately. If anything pierces through all the time warping. And I guess the melee bole blue is there helping. Oh, no, wait. As soon as I do this, obviously Stalker is going to spawn in. Me no rush. Me no nothing. No rush. Easy rush. Me no easy. Easy Nino. Boy, that is annoying. Not as annoying as Gabbett only existing. 
I think it was like bottom tiers on that tier list I saw. Yep, some showed up. Oh, it was Orochi. Well, I hit everything you got, so. Well, not before the Orologian breaks. Well, that was actually faster than the last time with Flasher with more damage. We have more DPS because of the time warp, but popped an Orologian I didn't want to. Yep, Starburst. It was either that or Stalker. And I guess Drown or two was an option, but not really the same threat the Starburst or the Drowner is. 26. Is it Blue Oni? Is it 27? 28 and 29 are HP scalers, which is why they get so stupidly durable. Uh, yeah, looks like Blue Onis have thrown in. Oh, and I got Chicken Fort too. Just prepping my mind for the nightmare to come. Got a bunch of melee bully blue set up. And here it comes. Yep. Even despite all this, they still got iron. Nope, oh, another Aura Logan here. They are they are what what is going on? Well, either way, I'm just going to chain them. That's the best strategy right now. Wait, houses. Wait, am I missing the house each time? I thought it was in the house. Why is it not in the house? Well, Time Warp has clearly saved the day here. No, it's because this was the one in the house. That was a random drop one. Okay, just take me, death. What? Oh, right, you got Time Warped. Oh, good on you, multi-stage missile. Okay, so I was thinking of changing up the Gavadoni weapon setup, but laboratory. So, gotta go full power right from the start. No choice here, no choice. Not surviving that tribal underway without it. Now, the real problem here is gonna be the evolution chest. Boy, is it gonna be that problem. That'll be more helpful than just getting the homie miss, but... Empty tomb. Pull it out of the pool. Or no, it's still in the pool. It's still in the pool! No, oh, seriously, this totally sounds like a Mega Man tune, right? Someone please agree with me, so I know I'm not insane. Really getting the cool. I got a single level on homie miss. No. Oh, there's prism, well, that's good. Yep, might as well max out the tomb while I'm here. Get that cooldown going. Then desperately try to hold out. I don't need wings at the moment. Focus on getting homie mess up. I can try maybe get an evolution. Because that's the first chest of the day, and sometimes it's funky and they can evolve. I don't know how laboratory evolves, though. Well, grab it now. One more. 
Yeah, that that figures. Ooh. Alright, here we go. Oh, it does evolve. Nice. Good. Good, 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 good. That'll solve a lot of issues, hopefully. Alright, get the weapon pick up. Blast and frost. I don't need melee bully blue. Yeah, I really do I want to try to go more to character strengths and you know like their complete opposites or whatever. When you got a weapon this bad to start out with, you need every edge you can get. Well, at least when I get back to Newt, be a lot better. Since then I can get Chaos in the Dark Knight with no issue. Wings of a Kappa. Not gonna stand here and wait. Gonna fly there and wait. Yes. Uh, oh, good grief. Here we go. Now I can try to hunt down Atlanteans. And annoying thing, jig, rar, word, hard, think bad, boom, boog, fire hot. Yep. Wow, you lasted no time at all, Yorutin. Or try blunder, tiny edition. I didn't even get... Okay, whatever. And I don't know where the Arcana spawn here, though that was pretty early. So just in case, I'll grab Wake now. Why does it keep doing this? Right, the first one is Santa Javelin, and then the rest of them switch off. Doing other things. It's just hard to tell if flashing for no reason there's even anything in there I mean, if I speed break not that I can if I speed break wait huh this a clover no other challenge stages do have the pickups Bonuses don't, but challenges do. That's why I'm counting Hectic Highway as a bonus, because it does. Well, Moonglow is a bonus. It does. Er. Well, Moonglow has everything. Everything in the base, at least. Oh, hey. There we go. Uh, enemies? Enemies, where you at? Okay, I guess I could just stay here and peace and harmony. Oh, no, I can't. Gotta survivors, them's vampires. In this vampire survival game. Let me see if I can try to replicate. Okay, kind of. You leave it and then come back in far enough, it seems to work. Alright, so remember that. Replicate that at least. I don't know what is up with the door though. It's like the caves. Cave overlay. But strangely, it doesn't seem like the only cave ever has that problem, right? Ooh, Aura Logan. These are the Robocopy Mega Mans. Copy as in a jock kind of cop. No, cop with an IE. Well, that just makes no sense. 
Oh, Arcana chest. You know, aside from a bit at the beginning and then the end with the tribal hunters, this challenge isn't all that tip. All those tribal hunters are just ridiculous. Absolutely nutty how durable they are. I suppose it's really hard to get stuff needed for Infinite Corridor or Crimson Shroud here. Oh. Oh, I can double up on the same room. You just move between the two of them, I guess. Have to go fully off screen? No. That feels. I don't know. Obviously, I can duplicate it, but the exact steps to duplicate it seem to be random and out of control. Yeah, that didn't refresh fully. Yeah, door still down. How far do you have to go? Nope, no switch there. Maybe it's only when there's a switch and I hit it? No. That wasn't making sense. I hit plenty of switches and didn't stop it. Oh, there's a switch to hit. Hey, Armadillo. How's it going, Armadillo? You still be in an Armadillo? You know why it's a suitcase when it's a candy box for the other one? Or an armoire. And it's supposed to be a suitcase, right? I think that's what I saw on the Discord. Shout out to myself. Why? I don't know. I don't want to shout out to other people. I don't remember names very well. Man, still only one Atlantean so far. Yeah, here we go to the 20. So many power-ups left in the dust. Oh, small tri blunders. Not an issue. Oh wait, out of bounds isn't gonna do anything against the final wave. They can't be frozen. That's not a good sign. Well, I maxed out on amount, and I got this NFT here. Should be 19, right? Not 18. Yeah, it's a single one of you. Ooh, and I got an Orlo again. Can't be frozen by that. Oh man, if you're taking that much damage. Oh, good grief. I mean, you couldn't get in, but it's going to be more on screen, and they're going to push themselves through. Well, I have NFT, and I have Orlo again. Should be enough. Orlo again first, and then NFT. Yep. Absolutely crazy. Slowly trickles in, and then bam, a million of them. Fire Tornado saved me. Fire Tornado did not save me. Does it continue if I... Yeah. Continues even if you revive. Good grief. No defanging either. It's three revives in less than 20 seconds. That's crazy. Oh, and another Warlogging go figure.
Good old out of bounds. Good old out of bounds. Well, that, that actually means I might actually get this video processed before the day it's supposed to be posted. That's nice. And we ended off with a nice relaxing trip to good old Moonglow. Surely I won't fall here like I did last time. That would be silly and ridiculous. Uh, where are my passes again? That was one of them. That was another. And the third is the strangely enough wings. Oh, hey, I already loaded up the bear. That's nice. Back with enough homing missile. What? Oh, that was the melee bully blue. Man, it looked weird. It looked like it was pronto laser. Air is obviously better at the moment. It affects more. Then you want empty tomb. Hey, surprisingly get a highish score here just because not enough combination of trash wave clear and concentrated tougher enemy clear. Charge up north. Oh, only that fires missiles. No. You do not get golden eggs from the merchant. That is Brad Fang territory. Boy, is that going to be weird. Well, I guess all my time playing Morrowind will, ex will be experience for that. Yeah, nothing like moving so fast you just glitch outside the walls the entire time. Have to sneak to actually get anywhere. Then your strength is so high, you snap every weapon in a single hit, and have to resort to using throwing stars. Morrowind! Man, it's so far away, strangely. Uh-oh, crab battle. Crab battle. Should I have held on that? Probably. And again, who knows if it would have actually evolved or not. Wow. Just wow. But the one I want most is homie miss. And you're not giving it to me. Wait, homie miss? Because it looks like a skirt if it had coil or stabilizing fins. But it doesn't. Is it just a joke because it's a homing missile that misses? Prism loss. Well, that's too maxed out. Still haven't gotten to the first Atlantean yet, but Wings is going to make that happen. Totally, 100%. Oh, zoom, zoom. Get them all up. I've not seen the volcano with Lantern here in forever, have I? No, that's usually not a good time. Look at all them prism lassie slashies going out. Nope, no evolution for Gavadoni. What's today? The worst day. It's tomorrow, a worser day. Uh, today should be pretty okay. Wow, that's that was right in the corner. I didn't even notice it. Huh. Yeah, I definitely do feel like Homie Miss has gotten a buff. I should check the Discord, see if there was an announcement about the patch that would have changed some of these things, because Neil Galaga didn't feel... Well, I haven't done inverse, and I don't want to do inverse, because it's scary. And we save a lot of time. When I fail. But I wanted to see if it had its scaling dialed back, because it was way too high. Enough that people actually commented on the videos about it. So, enjoying the content? I sure hope you are. If you haven't been, give me a 
all comment about why, and I'll see if I can make adjustments. Well, I'll try to make adjustments. I don't promise unless I intend to 100% keep it. Which is why I have not promised anything in literally years. Hey, two Atlanteans. But, I'm... Oh, no, it is. What? What the heck is that? It's literally on screen, but I'm like a mile away here. It's crazy. That's crazy. Blow them all up. Blow them all up. What am I doing? I want to get to Sun Atlantean. And the Melisan is the right time to do it, as long as I don't run into any more bloody Atlanteans. Alright, here's gonna come the weird plant thingies. Weird plant hybrid experiment things. Oh, hey, one of them went down. Well, I gotta get that golden egg. It's a power-up. Hey, well, it looked like it was a thousand miles away, and yet I got it immediately. I don't even... Where are you, Atlantean? You're not dead. Can't be dead. Took a couple minutes to get the... crowd battle. And to be precise... Oh, he just nicked me. Oh, Rosary. That was kind of helpful, I guess. Will you evolve? Yay, multi-stage missiles. Yeah, we got my DPS back. Oh, I don't even have a second weapon pick up. Whoa. I was running around with only one revive, two revives. Dangerous. Even on Moonglow, apparently. Oh, I didn't even touch him, jeez. His hitbox get extended. Come on, come on. You can do the time warp again. Let's do the time warp again. Put your hands on yours. And I have no idea what the chorus is. And awake just so that there's an arcana. Can't do the triple challenge here. Three weapons, three passives, three arcanas, three for the same character, three stages. I can't do it here. There's not three arcana for whatever reason. I don't know, the other 15 minute stages have it correctly. And I took down the city of Lantean at some point. Yeah, the plant things are called like experiment whatever. I'm always going to be finicking with this microphone because I have to have it off to the side in an odd direction. Yeah, that's why it sounds so inconsistent. And audio quality, as per Doki Bird's instructions, is the most important thing. Clearly, I should not be leading off with episode one, where I have no audio quality. There you are, Mini Atlantean. No, wait, you're called... No, you're just called Generic Atlantean here. Not like Mini or anything. You aren't Moon, you aren't Sun, you aren't a Volcano, and you certainly do not represent the city itself. Oh, is that how Atlantis sank in this cannon? A Volcano? No, 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 no. <laughs> Yay, done ahead of time. Okay, it took a bit more effort than it should have, but Gavadonia has taken down Mount Moonspell. Beaten up another stage, I don't even remember which one it was right now. Uh, laboratory. Wow, you beat Laboratory? It's a day after recording. And Moonglow is Moonglow. Thank you, Moonglow. Why did I hit 512?
No, it's 516. 17. 518. Yep, 518. Not 418, 518. If only. Thank you for watching. I hope you had some fun. And thank you for anyone who has liked, disliked, commented, subscribed. And if you haven't, please do so. Either way, have a good day and keep messing around in Vampire Survivors. This week.